Hi, welcome to Brad's Laboratory. Uh, today I'm going to hang a mirror in the stairwell of my house. My wife's been wanting me to hang this mirror for a while, um, but I've kind of been putting her off because I knew it was going to be more complicated. Not only because I'm on the stairs, so I have to get ladders out and try and figure out how to best support the ladder so I can climb up there without killing myself. And also, hanging the mirror, it's a pretty heavy mirror, and I want to make sure that it's not going to fall and kill somebody. So my uh, daughter likes to stomp up the stairs when she's angry and uh, if it's hung incorrectly it'll fall and <laughs> guillotine her, which I don't want. So uh, I am going to use these uh, things called togglers. If you've never seen these things, um, they're usually sold under the Healthy brand or under the, uh, I got a box there called, tog uh, they're sold under the toggler brand. things if you've never seen them um, they're like a like a old butterfly nut except you put them in the wall so you need a half inch hole or so to jam them in there and then you put them and you slide this piece down and then you snap these off and then your nuts in the drywall held in place by these kind of zip tie kind of things and then you can put your screw in and out multiple times so if you're having to take stuff on and off the wall super easy to do because the nut stays where you put it um, whereas the butterfly bolts once you put them in there you can't take them back out because the butterfly nut will fall down inside the uh, the wall so so these are pretty cool and they're also super strong um, these are the small like number 10 screw ones and these hold like 238 pounds or something on drywall per bolt so you know I'm probably gonna do four bolts so I'm gonna be well over the the weight of the uh, of the mirror. Um, probably, I think you're supposed to be about 10 times over the weight of the mirror for your uh, strength of, of fastening. I got to go to Lowe's though because I'm going to drill holes through the frame of the mirror to bolt it to the wall with the togglers and I, I need to come up with some sort of decorative cover for the screw heads or my wife is going to uh, complain. <laughs> I also catted this up to make sure the views were going to be right for both a, a full grown person as well as, as my daughter who's only nine. So, so some different heights there. So we'll get this installed and uh, right now I got to go to Lowe's and get the uh, decorative covers for the screws. Okay, so there's also this little plastic rubberish washer that goes on after the brass threaded thing. And then this will screw in through the mirror into the toggler bolt. And then I got these little caps that screw onto here that screw onto the brass thing. cover up the screw head so so it'll look nice 
That's the plan. It took forever to figure it out though. about a week um, for me hanging this mirror I had to order some parts from Amazon and uh, then machine some screws and it's just kind of been a pain but and and you might also notice that the white balance isn't off I actually wound up repainting this whole stairwell and upstairs hallway um, because I didn't have the paint that matched and my wife wanted this color anyways so um, after a large amount of painting for our weekend. Uh, I'm done and ready to hang the mirror finally. Um, I have my old stepladder set up and it, it is just perfectly at the to where I can set it on the stairs and lean it up against the, uh, the bottom wall there. I'm just going to set my mirror on there and match drill it and then we'll uh, work on getting the wall anchors in. Okay, here's the here's the toggler bolt. Yeah, it goes into the wall like that, so it kind of slides. And you need a hole that's half inch deep for the ones I'm using. I think the bigger ones are even bigger holes. Um, and then you slide it into the wall, and then twist it back, and then zip this down onto it. And it holds the, the nut inside the wall. Um, right now, I got to drill the drill out the holes I matched drilled out the half inch so I can put these in. two um, nuts put in the wall. I'm going to uh, put the mirror up and temporarily uh, install it with two screws so I can do the same thing at the on the top two holes. take the mirror back down and uh, put the toggles in at the top.
Thanks for watching. Please subscribe. And if you like the video, give me a thumbs up. I'm also on Patreon.